Hi, I'm Jacob Beals, and this is my show. And you ever see something that you're just like, oh, I don't know if I should get that, but you're so intrigued by it, you end up buying it anyway because it just looks so fun and so interesting? Well, for me, that was the case with... One second, I'm going to grab it. It's over here. I should have placed it right next to me, but I wasn't thinking. So now we got like this awkward transition. Ah, it'll be okay. Ring Fit Adventure for the Nintendo Switch. I first discovered this game on YouTube of all places. I'm on there a lot. This is where this video is going to be, in fact. But um, I was in front of one of the videos I was watching. It's actually several videos I watched. Because you know YouTube ads, they like to play in front of your videos. But that's okay. That's how we get YouTube. And anyway, this was one of... The, the ads that worked for me. I watched it. I was like, I got to get Ring Fit Adventure. And guess what? I did. It took me a while. I saw that ad like over a year ago, but I finally got it. I splurged a little bit at Walmart, but I've been so intrigued by this game because it, it looks so different than any other game. Look, you use a ring to play it. And it's not like you're running into the rings like Sonic. You're actually using the ring to play. And plus, I'm kind of a fan of, like, motion control gaming. You know, I was a big, big fan of the Wii. I absolutely loved it. And the Switch has some fun motion stuff going on with it, too. So I was like, this could be the next fun motion type game. And it, taking a concept, kind of doing something different with it. And I, I always like when games do that, too, when they, they do something unique with their gameplay. And I'm really hoping this one is that way. So we're going to unbox it. And guess what? We're also going to review it in this video. And it's going to be awesome. All right, so I don't want to destroy this box too much. I kind of like keeping my video game boxes all nice and clean. So we'll open it. Opens up. Nice. Looks pretty good so far. R right when you open it up, you got the Nintendo Switch game right there. Oh, nice. I like it. I like the cover. You got, I, I guess that's the Ring Fit lady. She kind of reminds me of the Wii Fit trainer from Wii Fit and, and Super Smash Brothers. You know her. And it's got these other looking characters on it, fun ones. I like that. I can't wait to play it. It's rated E10+. Plus. I wonder what the 10 plus thing is going to push it over the limit for. I'm not sure. But hopefully I'm ready for that. I hope uh, my parents let me play it. So next we got this little barricade that was blocking the game from the big thing that was in this box. The Ring of Destiny. I don't think it's actually called the Ring of Destiny. I just made that up. This thing's pretty sweet. It's actually a little bit bigger than I thought it was going to be. And it's got these comfy handles on it. Places for the Joy-Cons to go into. Oh, it's going to be awesome. Also, we got some kind of brace in here. Um, I'm guessing this is to help you hold on to the ring some way. So we'll put that on and see how it all goes. I was actually wrong. This is not a brace to help you hold on to the ring. It is actually a leg strap. Upon further inspection, I see that I was wrong. I've made an error and I'm sorry, but I'm excited to put on this leg strap regardless. I hope it fits. I, I've got some kind of big legs, so we'll see. Okay guys, as you can see, we got it installing right now. Pretty soon, we're gonna go on the Ring Fit Adventure. It's gonna be amazing, I can't wait. I got my ring here, and I also, I don't wanna make this weird, but I got my leg strap there, uh, and it's gonna be a good time. I'm glad I didn't record myself putting this stuff together because it was just getting embarrassing, guys. It would've been awful, but I'm so pumped to try this game. I hope it's so much fun. It looks fun, it looks so cool and creative. You know, as this game's loading, I wonder if I can play like Mario Kart with this or Animal Crossing New Horizons. Wouldn't that be fun? So this game actually has a controller update, which it's doing right now. That's new. We're updating the Joy-Cons, baby. It's awesome. It's different. I like it. Sorry for like the sudden horizontal view. I know that's probably weird. Some of you watching are on computers are like, oh my gosh, Jacob's video just went parkour on us and changed. But don't worry. It's all right. I just thought this would be a better view of my body. Not that any of you really want to see my body because I'm not an Instagram model or anything clearly, but I think it might do a better job of representing this game if I have things horizontal like this and me playing it. I'll just show a little bit of me playing it and I'll give you my thoughts afterwards. How's that sound? Good? Uh, you can't answer, but that's just what I'm going to do. I'm sorry. I got to. So I think this is the first time I've ever been asked this in front of a video game. Do you live in Canada or outside Canada? I'm outside Canada, but I love Canada. It's awesome. So I think to try this game out at first, I think I'm going to go to some of the mini games and just kind of test everything out and see what this game has to offer. And I think it'll give me a good feel of what this game does. This first mini game I'm playing is a lot of fun. It's called Robo Wrecker, and you kind of hold this like a wheel, you know, and you're squeezing and pulling to destroy like these little robot things that come in. Oh, it's it's so fun. 
and it's a little bit of a workout so far too. I mean, I was expecting that, but I like it. it. I think it's more of a workout than the weed was even. And oh man, I'm having a really good time. See so you pull and you push and just destroy these little like R2D2 robot thingies. And, oh, it's a good time. So this one is different. You got to put this between your legs and use your thighs to squeeze. And you got to sit down. And oh my gosh, it's so fun. But it's it's tough. You really have to squeeze hard to make this little vehicle jump. And it's fun. Uh, it's such a crazy game. It's definitely giving my legs a workout or my thighs. Sorry. Got to use the proper terms here. Oh, I just crashed into an explosion thingy. Guys, guys, guys. This one is fun. It's another robot uh, destroying game, which is kind of weird. There's a lot of robot destroying in this this game for some reason but you push this against your stomach and then you rotate it left and right to defeat these robots oh oh almost the one almost killed me but it's fun and it, it requires a workout you really got to stay on top of it to get all these robots and their shields and defeat them i feel like will smith and i robot except he was probably in more danger than i was right now because you know those robots were a lot smarter than these ones but oh man, this is, a, this is I think my favorite mini game so far. And it utilizes the, I almost want to call it the wheel, but the ring really, really well. I came to my first game where I kind of have to think a lot while I'm controlling because you have to like push down and then like do, go down like that. You have to push, then fall down because you're trying to climb like this tower. It's like Tom Cruise in Mission Impossible 4, except not as intense. I keep making all these action movie references but what I'm doing is not nearly as intense. Hey, I'm no Indiana Jones, but I got the the, 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 the trainer lady on here, just like we fit trainer, and she's awesome. I, I want them to make a movie about her. She needs to be in Super Smash Brothers. <laughs> like like we fit trainer. They let, her, they let those two in. Why not let this lady in? I think she's amazing. And let me tell you guys, this game's a lot of fun. I'm having a good time with it. Oh, I'm enjoying it so much. I, uh, I'm no Tom Cruise or Will Smith, but Hey, I'm trying my best, and I, 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 this might be one of my new favorite Switch games. I'm not even exaggerating. I'm having a blast. <laughs> oh, man. So I hope you guys enjoyed me playing a little bit of Ring Fit Adventure. I got a workout in there. I only played like four mini games, and I'm sweating. I really am. But from just the taste, the first reaction slash little review... I'm getting from this game. I, I, I really like it. I'm really enjoying it so far. It's a lot of fun. Like I say, it brings back memories of the Wii, but it works me out even more than the Wii did. And that's why I'm surprised this game isn't like a bigger hit. I know it's kind of a weird idea. It's like something you'd see on Shark Tank or something. Like people coming in and it's like, hey, we got this new idea for a video game, but you got to use this ring. And maybe that's why it hasn't taken off yet, but I think it needs to. I think a lot of people who maybe even aren't gamers would have a lot of fun with this game. I'm having a blast with it, and I can't wait to play more. I'm so happy I got it. It was worth the money. It was worth the splurge. But hey, if you have Ring Fit Adventure, tell me what your favorite game on it is. I'm going to try the adventure mode here pretty soon, see what it's like. I'm hoping it's awesome, but I love it so far. So good. I really enjoy it. Hey, and thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed me working out a little bit. This might be the only workout video I ever do. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, you're not going to see me shirtless or anything in the future, so don't worry. But this is Ring Fit Adventure. Lots of fun. Really good time on the Nintendo Switch. And until next time, I hope you're all doing well. Staying safe out there, and I'll be seeing you later. Bye, everybody.